Hey everybody, this is Paul, and I'd like to share how I made this, uh, I call it the palm tree trellis. So what I basically did is I got some four by fours, and this is not pressure treated wood, it's just uh, cedar or redwood, I can't remember. It's actually redwood. And I used something like this. And so I bought all this at Home Depot, and basically I just created a device, I guess, of, in where I just tighten the nuts to constrict around the tree. Now, in addition, I did carve the wood with the most dangerous tool I've ever used. This thing is gnarly. It spins very fast. My neighbor let me borrow it. What's it called? I have no idea. I call it the finger herder because I <laughs> damaged my finger like two weeks ago and it still doesn't feel right. So be very careful or you could use a different type of saw, but this is what I used. It worked pretty well and it was fun until I got hurt. And I just kind of shaved at the shape of the tree. And in this case, this queen palm is gonna be a great host um, in my opinion, for, for dragon fruit. So now, you're saying that you cut a little bit into the tree to groove it? Not, not the tree, I cut the wood. Come over here uh, okay. and look down. You can see here that I carved oh, okay. the wood. That makes sense. To kind of cup around the tree. This is a design that people uh, build tree houses with. Okay. So I kind of took that idea and adapted it for dragon fruit. And I can't adjust it over time. I could take it down if I wanted to. As the tree gets bigger, you can take some pressure off. Uh huh. And my only regret is I did this one a little bit too tight. This is version one. And you can see it kind of cracked the wood, just the outer layer. And that's because it's I tightened it too much. And check this out, Scott. It's really, really sturdy. You can see it definitely is not going to go anywhere. Now, all right, I put my feet on the tree. Look, here's no feet. <laughs> Just kidding. Where's the proof? Oh, you saw it? <laughs> There's the proof. See? All right, there you go. All right, a little cheesy, but it's Prove all there. Prove it. Yeah, it definitely proves it's strong. So we'll see how it works out, but uh, it's definitely a pretty economical trellis setup, I would say. And yeah, let's see. What, you, what do you have on here? Let's well, see. this is actually one of George's cuttings, and if I remember, it's GE number three. Nope, GE number one. So this is the first cutting that we planted and we are able to keep it all together. And hopefully it's gonna start showing some growth soon. Nice. So there you go, there's our palm tree trellis. And this is kind of the shady part of the palm tree, huh? Yes, um, so I put it on the shade side and we'll see how it does. I think it's gonna do great here. All right. All right, give us a like, subscribe, keep them coming.